What's up guys, it's Bye Bye here with another Rise of Kingdoms video. Today video, I will show you guys how I do my bet on the Grand Final or Savage League Season and some tips and advice for you guys on how you should be uh, placing your bettings. Uh, first thing first, uh, we want to know what are some of the items that are worth risking for. So let's go into the shop here and we'll see. So like out of all the like six items available in the shop, for the grand final is the only item the only item that like is worth risking for is the equipment material choice chest uh be, because it's a legendary uh a grazer uh it take for a long long time it take a long long time for you to get like one piece of legendary equipment materials so this is probably the only item the only item in the shop that was risking for lies the decoration here is it like nobody care about it to be honest and some of the other some of the, uh, the other item is it, 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 it is really not worth uh, risking your coins for so your goal your ultimate goal your ultimate goal for when it comes to a betting for the grand final is that you want to get 4000 coins you want to get 4000 coins so that you can clear you can buy two of the legendary equipment material choice chests here so you want to bet in a way so that you can get that 4,000 coins. Um, so, with that being said, uh, when making the bet, you also have to look at the return on, on investment as well. Like the ratio, so as of right now, if you're betting on OV, you only get like 10 for one. So, or if you're pay, betting on V6, you get one for 10. So, um, if, if you are going to bet on OV, they force you to get 4,000 coins, by next match you will need to bet a total of 3650 coins on them if they win the grand final is over then no third uh, match uh, and you have uh, around 4000 coins and you can buy two legendary legendary material choice chests there but if you don't have 360 3650 coins by saturday it is not worth it for you to bet on OV. Because like if you have less than 3650 coins and you bet on OV, even if they win, you still cannot buy both legendary material chests because you do not have enough 4000 coins. Uh so it's it's not worth it. Um and instead, you should you should use 2000 coins. So use 2000 coins, buy out one of the equipment materials equipment material choice chest and use the rest to bet on v636 so for example right now let's say by saturday i only have a 2600 coins on my account i am going to use 2000 coins to bet to buy out that uh, legendary equipment material choice chest so that i have one in my inventory with 600 coins left i can bet on v636 and if v636 win i got 6000 coins and I can buy the additional uh, legendary equipment material choice chest there. Uh, like if I have a 2,600 coins, like if I bet on OV, like if they win, I got what 3,000, 3,200 coins, and I still cannot buy two legendary material choice chests. So what? Why? Why betting on OV if you don't have uh, the enough coins for you to get to that 4,000 coins, right? Because there are really no other items that are, that are really worth risking your coins for. So you want to wait. So another, another reason why I never bet very early on. Like I always, I always, always wait until the very, very last day. For one is to see the ratio and for two to see, like to do some of like calculation to see wh where should I put, it, put my bet on and how can I maximize on my coins. How, like what item I need in the shop. So, so that is if you do not have a 3,650 coins by Saturday. I think that applies for a lot of people who lost the previous bet. So like if you lost, if you lost the previous bet, uh, you most likely not going to be able to get to that 3,650 coins by uh, Saturday. And it's, it's really, really not worth it for you to bet on OV. So you should like keep betting on V636 again. And you're going to have a chance. And depend on how much coin you have. Uh, Look at the ratio, like, all you have to do is to bet like 300, 400 coins on V636 and you can get, if they win, you can, you can get 4,000 coins 
or like if you have a 2000 if you can get to a 2600 coin like myself right now they are for you 2000 coins just to buy out one one of the metal choice chests here and to bet the rest on v636 the second scenario is that if you're going to have more than 4000 coins by saturday uh so if you have more than 4000 coins by saturday like so as i said before like the only item that are, are the only item that is worth risking for is the legendary equipment material choice uh so if you have more than 4000 coins like i would strongly recommend you just to buy out the equipment legendary equipment material choice chest here and just use the rest of your coins to bet on v636 like v636 has the like highest return on on investment right now and like with that small investment small amount of coins you have left after you buy out the two uh, material choice chest if you bet on v636 if they win you go win big again and you can clear out the shop like if you bet on ov you you pretty much win nothing so uh those are some of like tips and advice i want to give for you guys if you guys are still undecided on like which team you should be betting for definitely check the amount of coins you need to buy out the two equipment material choice chest here and see how much coin you have and see if you can get to that 4000 coins by the end of the grand final here and like you gotta make your bet in a way so that you can buy out the items like you don't bet like if you want to be competitive like sometimes you have to bet against the teams that you want to win like for me like last last uh last round i bet on ov because i think they have a higher chance of winning even though i want v636 to win but for me as a player i need the coins like doesn't matter what team win winning at the end of the day I still want to have that 4,000 coins so that I can buy out the two legendary equipment material choice just here. So you gotta be smart when it comes to the betting. Uh, betting on a team that can give you the amount of coins you need to clear out the shops. Anyway guys, I hope you guys find this video informative and useful in some way to help you with like the betting for the grand finals. Thanks for watching the videos.